हेलो चिल्ड्रेन आई एम योर टीचर मिस तुलसी जय प्रकाश फ्रॉम संस्कृति स्कूल एंड आई एम कोको वी आर हियर टुगेदर टुडे टू टेल यू अ स्टोरी हुरे इट्स स्टोरी टाइम यस इट्स स्टोरी टाइम चिल्ड्रेन व्हाट इज द स्टोरी दैट वी आर गोइंग टू टेल टुडे वेल कोको टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू अ स्टोरी नेम्ड काला सैंडविचेस Carla sandwiches? Yes, Carla sandwiches. Children, are you ready for the story? How about you, Coco? Oh, I am ready. Yes. So, children, Carla was a little girl who bought weird sandwiches to school. Sandwiches? Yes, Coco. Do you like sandwiches? Well, I love them. How about you? I also love sandwiches. Very good. But here Kala used to bring weird sandwiches to school. And it was one boy, Buster, who noticed it first. Buster was sitting next to Kala and having lunch on one Monday. And when Kala was eating her sandwich, Buster saw it. And he said, "You, what are you eating, Kala? It's all green and slimy." Hearing this, Kala said, It's an olive pickle and green bean sandwich. I made it myself. Would you like some pasta? I bought extra. Oh. It's gross, said Pasta. I don't want it. It's not gross. It's different and I like to be different. Yes, Kala is different. Yes, Coco, Kala is very different. But Pasta did not agree to it. It's not different. I didn't like it. I'm going to go from here. Saying this, Buster went and sat next to another girl, Leslie. Poor, poor Carla. She was left alone. She had to eat her lunch alone. Okay. On Tuesday, Carla bought another sandwich. Oh, what was the sandwich this time? Well, Salas Carla sandwich today. was a long sandwich with something yellow and white oozing out at the sides seeing that what in the world is that asked leslie remember leslie the girl next to whom buster went and sat so leslie was seeing carla's sandwich and asking what it is it's my banana cottage cheese delight a very tasty sandwich Hearing this, Leslie was like, "Banana and cottage cheese? Oh, I don't want it. It doesn't look good. That's disgusting." "It's not disgusting. It's creative." "No, it's disgusting." So Leslie saying this, she went and sat next to another boy named Nate. "Okay, children. Now on Wednesday, Carla bought another sandwich." and this time the sandwich was orange and brown and lumpy it crunched when she bit into it oh <clears throat> color what's that asked nati so kala said it's kala's crunch it's peanut butter crackers and cheddar cheese do you want some it's very tasty i have bought extra Listening that Nate was like no way that's not nice i don't want it saying this nate went and sat next to marcus but kala said no nate it's unique but no one was there to listen to kala so again everyone left kala and they went and sat with others kala was left alone poor kala Yes, Coco, poor Carla. But Carla did not stop bringing such sandwiches. You know what she did? On the next day, she bought another sandwich. On Thursday, Carla bought a chopped chicken, potato chip, and cucumber sandwich. Oh, that's different. Yes, that's different. But again, none of them sat next to her. On Friday, she brought a fish. and mustard sandwich some sun 
flower seeds topped on it. Yum! That's very, very different. Yes. But again, children, nobody was sitting with her. Everyone went away from her and sat with others. Poor Kala, she was sitting alone during her lunch break and had her lunch. So by Monday, no one wanted to sit next to her. So Kala ate by herself. Poor Kala, right children? At the end of the day, their class teacher, Miss Pimento, entered the class. And she made an announcement. Tomorrow, we will have a picnic. Hearing this, all the kids started shouting, Hooray! A picnic! Yippee! So all of them were very happy. So the next day, when the lunch bell rang, ting 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 ting, the kids ran to get their picnic lunches. So they were all ready to go for the picnic. So every one of them was shouting what they have bought for the picnic. So Nettie said, I have peanut butter and jelly. Leslie said, I have bought chicken sandwiches. Whereas Pastor said, I have bought tuna sandwiches. And then everyone looked at Carla. And Buster asked, Carla, what have you bought? But Carla did not answer. She was very quiet because she knew that everyone will make fun of her. She was very silent. When Carla didn't answer, others said, I think it will be probably a ketchup, spinach and some bean sandwich. So all were making fun of Carla. But Carla said, it's not. It's a very tasty sandwich. Everyone was laughing at her. Every kid made fun of her. Hearing this loud noise, their class teacher, Miss Pimento, came and said, Let's have some quiet in here. Be quiet, children, or we won't be able to have a picnic. When Miss Pimento said that, all of them became quiet. Very good. Yes. All of them became quiet. And then what happened, you know, they started having their food. Everybody was having their snacks. They had their lunch. And then there was Buster. Buster was opening his bag and he was searching for his food. He was searching his bag and he was looking at it. But he was not able to find his food. There, he suddenly looked at Carla. And he saw that Carla was having some sandwich and he asked, What is that? Sandwich, Carla? Carla replied, Well, Buster, it's a lettuce, tomato, raisin and bean sprout man sandwich. It's a very tasty sandwich which is very healthy also. But listening that, Buster started laughing. <laughs> I don't think that would be tasty. I have a tuna sandwich. It is very yummy. But Carla did not say anything. She continued her eating. And Buster, he went on searching his bag. Okay, so Coco, he was searching his bag for his sandwich. He rummaged through his bag. But he was not able to find his sandwich. Oh, oh, I can't believe it. I did not bring my sandwich. Buster cried. Oh, that's very awful. Leslie was so sad. Hearing that, Eva Nate said, Oh, very bad. You don't have anything to eat. But Buster was so silently searching. Where are my sandwiches? He was searching, searching, searching. But he couldn't get it. Soon, everyone was eating. Everyone except Buster children. Oh, so Buster must be hungry. Yes, everyone was eating. But Buster was not eating. So Carla looked at Buster. She looked at her sandwich in her hand and then again at Buster. Again he looked, she looked at her hand. She was thinking, should I offer the sandwich to Buster? So Carla went and told Buster, you can have one of mine. I have bought extra. But all the other kids hearing this, they started laughing. 
No thanks, I don't want. Buster was not ready to accept it. Again, Kala asked, You see, do you want one? But again, Buster said no. He was just watching all the other kids eating their lunch. Oh, how sad, right? Yes, feeling hungry. Even I cannot remain hungry. Yes. Soon, what happened is, Buster was so hungry that her stomach began to growl. Oh, he was feeling so hungry. So, Buster eyed Kala's sandwich. Should I eat it? So, thinking that, again, he looked at Kala. Kala sang out, You don't know what you are missing. Buster couldn't take it anymore because he was very hungry. So he went to Kala and he said, Okay. So Kala asked, Okay what? Okay. Can I have one? Can you have one what? Buster loudly said, Can I please have one of your sandwich? All the other kids looked at him. Everyone was surprised. Buster was asking for Kala's sandwiches. Kala smiled and then she handed Buster her sandwich. Well, Buster, this is my sandwich combo deluxe. You can have it. Buster looked at the sandwich. He found that the sandwich had some raisins. He also found that there were some vegetables. There was tomato. Bean, bean sprout. So Buster was like, Okay, this is all right. I'll have a taste. I'm very hungry. So Buster had one bite. All the other eyes were watching as Buster chewed and swallowed. So Buster was chewing. Well, how is it? Leslie asked. Well, how is it? Niti asked, but here Buster was not saying anything. You know what Buster did? He was chewing and chewing. He was continuously eating. And again he had another bite, another bite, another bite. I can't believe he is eating it. Children said, oh my God, how can he eat it? Another child said, that's not good. Yes, so all were like so surprised. But Buster didn't answer. He was too busy eating. And when the last bite was gone, Buster licked his fingers and smacked his lips. Yum! That was the best sandwich I ever ate. It was! Leslie was so surprised. It was? Nati was also surprised. Yes, it was, Pastor said. And Carla was smiling. Yes, Carla, that was very, very tasty. I bet you will all enjoy it. Take Carla's combo deluxe. So all the children, they wanted to have Carla's combo deluxe sandwich. Everybody started raising their hat. I want, I want. But Carla had only one sandwich with her. Do you know what Carla did? She took her sandwich, cut it into small pieces. And after that, she gave it to everyone. So tell me, Coco, how would it have tasted? What do you think everyone would have said? I bet it would have tasted very delicious. Yes. When they had their sandwich, they said, Wow, that's terrific. Everyone said that it tastes great. And then they understood her sandwiches were very tasty. Seeing her sandwich, Leslie said, Tomorrow I'm going to bring a very different sandwich just like Carla bought. It is going to be a very different one. And maybe I can have something like a mustard sandwich with some baked beans and french fries. So what do you think of it, Carla? So Carla said, sounds good. Why not? Why don't you try? 
so all the children were so much happy eating that sandwich after their picnic the next day when children came to the class every one of them bought a very different sandwich a very different sandwich yes a very different sandwich yes kako each of them bought their own creative sandwich but they all wanted to know what carla bought so they all asked carla what did you bring what is a carla what is today special but you know what carla said oh you have to wait till lunch break i won't tell it now okay so everyone was waiting for lunch time and when finally the lunch bell rang ting 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 everyone was having their sandwich pasta was munching away on her spaghetti and soy sauce sandwich he glanced over at carla carla what is that sandwich well carla said well pasta that's a very simple sandwich today i have bought only a cheese sandwich only a cheese sandwich yes only a cheese sandwich oh oh so today carla has bought something very simple yes would you like to have some and carla offered her sandwich and every children had it so all of them were very happy and they had their sandwiches and they understood that you should never judge anything by looking at it you should be creative and never make fun of someone because they do something very differently and that way kala sandwiches became very popular yes so how was the story oh that's very nice i understood that we should not make fun of others when they do something very differently yes so children that's the moral of the story be creative and never make fun of others just because they did something very differently so i hope you have enjoyed the story until i see you again bye